What is up guys? Today I'm going to be talking about William Nylander mock trades that could possibly happen. Like, let's just get into it. So first up, I have William Nylander for Martin Meechus and Brett Pesci. Well, um, this is an interesting one. Um, I like it because, I like it for Carolina because they get a good winger basically to replace Patch Reddy. Except new under, uh, like a better version of Bre uh, of Max Petretti, and the Leafs get a great center in Martin Regis, who's on a great contract, two million dollars, and they get Brett Pesci, who's also on a great contract, three million dollars, and so they get one defenseman at least to fit in their lineup, and then. Someone can be their scratch, and then you have Martin Nietzsche who can replace Nylander. Like, this is a win win for both sides. Like, Carolina um, will be sad about losing uh, one of their best defensive pieces and one of their best centers, but they get a great winger who can score and deek and do all kinds of stuff offensively. Just he's never been great on the defensive end. So, yeah, that's my favorite trade of the video. That's why I wanted it to go first. Next up, I'm thinking we could do William Nylander to the Colorado Avalanche for Valerie Nachushkin and a second round pick plus a, a third round pick and so two second round picks and a third round pick. You guys might think this trade's kind of bad, but really, is not that much worse than Nylander. He's actually pretty underrated. And he's almost the same player as Nylander. And you guys can criticize me as much as you want in the comments. But this trade is good. The Leafs finally get some draft capital because they have like, among the least amount of picks in the league and like they get another great winger and Colorado needs another winger with Gabriel Landeskog injured so I really like this this is uh that's another great trade approved by me and the final trade I have William Nylander for Tommy Novak, Ryan McDonough, and a fourth round pick. Yeah, guys, you might call me crazy for this one, but Tommy Novak's actually really underrated. He's a great center. And then we also get a great defense. He, Ryan McDonough's a bit old, but he's still productive. You want him in the playoffs. Like, it's a loss for Tampa for him to, for, than to lose Ryan McDonough, and now he's on the Predators, and I like this one. Tommy Novak, Ryan McDonough, and a fourth round pick. Well, do you guys like it? I don't know. Like, again, we get another good defenseman, and then we get a great center who will be who will fit perfect on the third line, and then we can move David Camp to the fourth line, and then we also get another great defensive piece to add to our core. What do you guys think? Bye, guys.